Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the face just uh, just and welcome back to uh, World of Warcraft. In this video we'll be taking a look at the ruins of Ankiraj, which can be found in Silithus over here in Kalimdor. In order to get to here you're gonna want to go to either Orgrimmar or Stormwind and take the portal uh, down to the Caverns of Times, which is located in Tanaris, then fly through Ungoro Crater, and Silithus is right down over here. So basically just go like this. And over here will be the Ruins of Ankiraj and the Temple of Ankiraj. In case you don't see the map like this, and you don't have all of this, but instead there's a giant sword, Go over here and talk to Zidormi, she'll switch you back to your original, to the previous timeline that was here. Then from here we can just head on over down here to the ruins of Ankiraj. And essentially we're just going to fly on over here. You'll have two entrances, you're gonna want to go to the one on the left. Now Ankiraj, um, da, 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 let's see what does it say here. Yeah, a bunch of great items that can be vendored. You'll have uh, a bunch of tokens will drop, which you can turn into the vendors. Uh, that is the reputation holder, because this is all scenario and hold. These guys, you'll be able to get a cloak, a ring, and a ring cloak, and... And the weapon at Exalted, my bad. But you need to collect the scarabs and the idols that you can get. You can get the scarabs from uh, the scarab chests. You can also get the, uh, the tokens from the bosses themselves. Now, basically, the bosses are relatively simple. You just go in and you one-shot them. But essentially, I will just show you. You're going to want to head on over here, then to Buru the Gorger. AM is the Hunter, then Osar is the Unscathed, then Moam. Moam should be the last one you do. Then you can just make a full circle and exit out of here, but in any case... There we go, there is Kurimax, and you'll get this Carab Coffer Key. And you can also skin these guys, in case you're a skinner. And right, the Scenarian Circle will actually reinforce you with that, but... Right, there are also these guys that you'll need to actually follow them through. Right, so th that is another thing that I wanted to show you. We got the Scarab Coffer Key, which isn't really that uh, bad, I will show you where it's at. I believe the first one is somewhere relatively close by here. Mm -hmm. Okay, doesn't really matter, I don't really need it. But in any case, there is a secret vendor. This guy is a secret vendor. Go ahead and talk to him and just go, let's find out. And you're gonna want to follow him, he's a bit of a diehard. And essentially we're just going to head on over here, then you're gonna wait, a uh, wave upon wave of enemies are going to come, and you're just going to eliminate them. But you let them get the first hit in. There we go. There we go, they got the first hit in, kabam. As you can see we're getting reputation with the Scenarian Circle. You let them get the first hit in, bam, annihilate them. Okay, they got the first hit in, annihilate them. Pay attention to his health, you don't want him to actually die. There we go. As you can see, there are all different types of captains over here, but you're gonna want to actually allow them to come to you. Over here, so you can actually gain access to him as a vendor. So we're just going to wait, 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 bam. There we go. There we go. And 
Nice. Okay. Wait for them. There we go. Eliminate them. Then we wait for him. Now it's very important that he gets the first hint in on the general. There we go. You will die, you will get the reputation bonus, you just lose him. There we go, then what you can do is actually talk to him and you'll unlock a merchant. But you will need a uh, reputation with the Sonorian Circle for these two blacksmithing things. But it's also handy to have a vendor within here. But let me just show you this care up. Ah, there we go, it looks like that. Uh, you can more likely find them on the auction house because basically a lot of people are farming a lot of stuff all the time so you might as well find them but you will use one key to open up one scarab coffer and there you will get these idols which you will need to combine with the uh where is it that with the regal drape for example and the scarabs that you get from here now these carobs are good and if you plan on farming out the sets and everything else that you can get from here my recommendation would be for you to actually hold on to the scarabs because you will need it for the other instance as well and the rewards it brings.